big pyramid to fight the Thunderjaw. I can get it from my stash later. A barbarian! Run, stranger! There's the a machine killer machine will kill about! You. There you are. I guess we're doing this. sent me I need to speak to Alva by all means then open the gate I'm glad you're okay. Oh, you got rid of that machine. But what are you doing here? There's something inside Thebes that I need. I went to Landfall. I met your CEO. We came to an agreement, kind of. And you're going to help us get in? I guess so. The whole thing was a little tense. There was something off about that guy. And I don't understand what he wants from Thebes. I thought we found the data that your people needed back on the mainland. That data will take us years to sift through. The seal wants faster results. Aloy, you have to be careful. He's... There they are. The legacy tells us that Elizabeth Sobek helped the ancestors cast aside all obstacles. And so it has been today. You have been true to your word. I'm pleased. Thebes awaits us below, shall we? Quite an excavation. Much of this was flooded. We had to pump a great deal of water out.
Behold, the door to Thebes. A door like no other. Well, you're right about that. It's designed to open for only one man. Ted Farrow. But the legacy tells us that he worked closely with Sobek. He trusted her. Surely she could open the door, and so surely can you. Not gonna happen. At least not from this side. You said she was a living ancestor with Sobek's eternal essence. Uh, if I may... Pharaoh, great as he was, did not build his palace alone. We know this from scraps of data we found, the ones that pointed to this location. And we found evidence of passages below. Maybe they were built to aid construction. Or for servants. We can't reach them. The way is flooded, and they're too far underwater, but... I... Yeah. I can reach them. There might be another way in down there. You see? With Sobek, there is always a way. Then do what you must to get us inside. There's a rupture up there. Maybe a way in. Yeah, this could get me inside. Stop the turbine. Good.
Okay, I'm on the side, but I'm gonna let the coin in. It looks like an exercise room. Here I am again, hiding in the gym, writing to stay sane in this crazy place. I can't believe Gregory's dead. Our so-called spiritual leader was fine yesterday, and then suddenly passed away in his sleep, and no one will talk to me about it. They treat me like a child, whispering behind my back, as if I can't cope with death, even after the end of the world. So Ted had other people in here with him, including a teenage girl. The living area. It's pretty big, too. There's nothing normal about a scientist, his daughter, a guru, and, well, let's face it, a harem living through the end times in the trillionaire's underground survival bunker. But now that gregory has gone, I'm worried things will get even weirder. He helped keep Ted stable for a couple of years, sort of. Without him, who knows? And we don't even understand what happened to him. The girl's right. Nothing normal about Ted. I know everyone's reeling after Grigori's uh, untimely demise. He was a deeply spiritual man who wasn't afraid to rip back the curtain and gaze where few men dare. I've asked Dr. Sumtau to, you know, check on what happened to him. I'm sure he had some kind of condition or something. The main point is that while we certainly miss him, we will go on. Everything's gonna be okay. Yeah, something tells me it didn't turn out that way. This is the way to the main door, so I can let the Quinn in. Look at this place. It's pretty fancy for a survival bunker. There, the door. Let's hope I can open it from the inside. Most of Ted's women repulse me, okay? They're like contestants on a housewife sim preening for the hubby's attention. 
But Brianna, the Hollow Singer, she's different. She's always been nice to me. And I love her voice, which has been conspicuously silent since Grigori died. She doesn't speculate or gossip like the others. She knows something. I can tell. And I'm gonna find out what it is. Emergency exit function. Emergency exit. The door is open. Destiny is upon us. I knew you could do it. What's going on? The CO is preparing to enter Thebes. Dressed like Ted Pharaoh. I am Pharaoh, renewed. My essence is the same as his. Across the years, across the generations, his soul is my soul. His will is my will. We are sundered in only one way. I need his final testament, his deepest secrets. And now that the door is open, those secrets are within my grasp. When I have them, I will be complete, as he was. I will have everything I need to save our homeland, and, as Pharaoh did, the world. Okay. I think there's some confusion here about who Pharaoh really was. No one knows better than I who he was, who he is, me. The Renewer, greatest of the ancestors, the man who saved the world, and you. You understand, Sobek. You are her, Pharaoh's harbinger, his assistant. Come, we will descend into Thebes together, as it should be. Bring her the raiment. Raymond? As he is Pharaoh, you are Sobek. For an occasion, this momentous, shouldn't you wear proper business attire? Whoa. No, 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 no. No, I am not wearing that. No way. You will wear the proper attire to mark this moment. Or what? It is said Sobek valued life above all else. Is this true? Fine. I'll wear your raiment. Proceed. Look at this place. The grandeur. Pharaoh's domain. Simply breathtaking. Excellent. Somewhere in here, Pharaoh left his secrets. Let's go find them. Your Magnificence. Perhaps we should leave guards behind to cover our exits? Indeed. And let it be done. Pharaoh's visage. A monument to greatness. Truly, my son. It's a monument to something. I'll give you that. I think this way might lead down. Excellent. 
Remember every detail of his, Bohai, for posterity. It will be its own chapter in your legacy. Quite a palace Pharaoh built for himself. No less than he deserved. Of course, your eminence. Wonder if Pharaoh had a foot bath in here. I've always wanted one. There will be no further discussion of your feet, Bohai. Brianna told me that Gregory hacked into restricted files and found out something awful. That Ted murdered important people who worked on Zero Dawn. Did Ted punish Grigori? Kill him for discovering what he did? How could that be? Dad said there wasn't a mark on Grigori's body. His heart just gave out. Find anything interesting? I am... Um, I can't make sense of it yet. So hey, this is weird. Yeah, I tried to warn you. Yeah, sort of. I'll explain everything if we survive long enough. Those certainly look threatening. Huh. Statues. The guardians of Pharaoh's domain. Those aren't statues. Look out! Get the CO out of here! This is just us, then. Overseer Bohai. He has decided to return to the surface. A wise choice. We can't afford to lose any more diviners than necessary. So, no more delays. We must proceed. Brianna didn't wake up this morning. She's gone. Just like Grigori. Did you discover some data? A fragment. A, a testament to Ted's power. Ah. Brianna didn't wake up this morning. She's gone. Just like Grigori. I'm looking up at the giant, hideous statue of Ted in the Great Hall. At his eyes. And I know now that he's watching. He's watching us all. He's always had power over us. I just never knew how much. Yes, that looks like the way.
When I built this place, when its special systems were designed, I knew what I wanted. Protection, of course. An unlimited power source, that was a given. But also... Control. Over every possible eventuality. After all, you never know what will happen, especially when the human element is involved. What did you find? Trust me. You don't want to know. I guess I don't. Ever deeper we go. throne attached to some kind of apparatus I wonder what it does an impressive setup what is it for I'm sorry CEO I don't know my focus can't read the data here what about the living ancestor is the data lost to her Scan the device, if you will. You did this for him? You put, like, Please, off scan switches the in everyone's heads? Kenya, you mustn't judge me. I had no choice. If I said no, what would he do to us? What would he do to you? You're my little girl. I was trying to keep you alive. Tell me For what, what your focus reveals about the device. Seriously, why? So we can be trapped in this underground nightmare? You know what we have to do. Please. Did you find a recording, Aloy? Yeah. I'll share it with you later. Scan the device, if you will. Please, scan the device. Made a minor adjustment to the gene therapy regimen and added a new cocktail to treat the symptoms caused by the mutations. Hopefully, there will be some stabilization after the next treatment. God knows what Ted will do to us if there isn't. The early results were so promising. No signs of aging, no cellular degeneration, but now... Oh, if only I had access to my old lab in Bangkok, or my old colleagues. 
or my old liquor cabinet. Stop it. Got to stay positive. For Kenya. You saw something. I could tell. Did the data explain what Pharaoh used this device for? I think he was undergoing treatments to live longer. A lot longer. Really? Could he still be alive? Don't be foolish. If he were alive, he would have kept his essence. It would not have been passed down to me. Remember, he was the renewer. Of course he would have stopped at nothing to grasp the secrets of life and death. But not for himself. Everything he did was for a new beginning. For us, for the Quen. And for his true heir, me. You know, I'm starting to think you're right. You do have a lot in common with Ted Farrow. I knew you would see, in time. Let us continue. His secrets await. Hmm. Is that a small office? For a minor functionary, perhaps? geothermal energy plant right under the city of San Francisco. A marvel. Even I can run it, and let's face it, I was always more of a visionary than an engineer, which is why I had the foresight to insist on the inclusion of a very unique feature, just in case anyone ever tries to steal my cheese, so to speak. door down. I'm going to look for another way in. Good idea. It's worked before. Very well. Get to it. Ah, is that a vent of some sort? Not a bad idea. this morning holding hands 
must have poisoned themselves. I never would have put them to sleep. She was just a girl, for Christ's sake. I offered them life, and this is how they repaid me, by leaving me all alone. But I guess I've been alone since this whole thing began. Alone in bearing the burden for the past, for the future. Same old Ted. No matter who dies, he's the one feeling sorry for himself. Less his future, less his children. Someday they'll come, and I'll be here to greet them. Sometimes that my aging has stopped altogether. If anything, my cells are replenishing faster than normal. I just need some time for the mutations to calm down. Time. And energy. Sometimes if they're reacting, give me what I need. To grow strong again. To get my shit back together. So I can greet the kids. They're gonna need me. My advice. My guidance. And then I won't be alone anymore. Pharaoh's secrets. Are they here? Uh, not the ones you're looking for. Then they must be in there. Trust me. You don't want to go in there. Are you mad? I haven't come all this way to stop now. Pharaoh's legacy is mine. to melt down if... Kill them too. No witnesses.
we found something that will help. Not just your homeland, but everywhere. But where's the CO? Oh, he's... gone. I guess you could say he gave his life to help us attain the secrets of Thebes. I see. You must think I'm eminently stupid. What? No. No. The CEO was an entitled egotist who twisted our beliefs into a sickening, self-serving fantasy. And you expect me to believe he sacrificed himself for scraps of data? It's time for the truth, and it better be convincing. Otherwise, I'll simply order these soldiers to open fire. Hold on. You're right. To be honest, the CO screwed everything up. He brought Thebes down around our ears and died like a gutless coward. But... We really did find something down there that will help your homeland. If I can take it, and use it. Now if I have to, I will fight my way out of here, but it doesn't have to be that way. You can just let me go. And then take credit, when things start to improve. Success certainly does sound better than failure. It seems, then, that our destinies are intertwined. Landfall is open to you. If it will help your cause, you may come and go as you please. But Alva must join you and report back on your efforts. Fair enough. Thebes is of no further value to us. Obviously, we're going back to the flotilla. Alva, I expect your reports to be thorough. Oh, I thought he was going to have us killed. Oh, and instead, I get to join you. Glad to have you. But you're going to need a little help to reach our base. Varl, I made a new friend. I need you to meet her at the Quen Ferry and escort her back. On it. Can't wait to meet her. Trust me, you'll love it there. Varl will give you a better focus and all the data you could ever want. Head to the ferry. I'll join you back east as soon as I can. A diviner must follow the truth, wherever it leads. I'll see you there. Now that I have Omega clearance, we should have what we need to capture Hephaestus. But before I head to the ferry, maybe I should stop by Landfall. With the CO gone, maybe more Quen will be willing to talk. Might be worth looking around the island, too. I gotta change out of these clothes. I can't believe the CO made me play dress-up.